sometimes you get a Google Doc template or a Google Spreadsheet template, and you and you try to use the template, and that that new copy of it, the private copy that you're using for yourself, ends up in the wrong Google account or the Google Drive account that you weren't intending for it to copy to. So let me show you on the screen what that might look like for you and what you can do about it. So here's my screen. And uh, let me go ahead and find the correct screen to share with you here. OK. All right. So you can see here on my screen, uh, there is a use template. Click here for the spreadsheet template. I'm going to go ahead and click on this to show you. All right. So I'm going to click on use template now. And so what happens is now I've, I've created a private copy. I clicked on use template. I was already logged into my Google Drive account. And then now there's, it's, th this is a private copy within my Google Drive account. First thing you should always do is to rename this. You know, it's like, like you know, uh, I'm to say my name is Jane. <laughs> Jane Doe's business plan, whatever. Okay, renamed it. Now, the thing you should check is click on yourself, your, your little bubble in the top right corner. And notice, hmm, is this the right Google account that I want this template in? And let's say my answer is no, I want this in my regular account, not my George Cal team account. Oops. So here's what you do. You could have gone into another browser tab or another browser profile, sign in to your correct account before you clicked on use template and put the yeah, you know, but let me show you. That's a little complicated for for most of you watching this. So I'm just going to show you an, a, a more a more simple way of doing it. So this is this is in your incorrect account. Simply click on the share button on the top right, and then share it with your correct account. So share. I'm going to share it with my correct account, which is George Cow, George Cow at at gmail.com. Okay, I'm going to share it with my correct account. And I'm going to make my correct account editor. I'm going to notify my correct account as well. I'm going to click send. Okay, now the next step, let's say I don't want this template in my incorrect account, okay? I don't want this template in my George Cal team account. I, I, I wanna remove it from this account. What do I do? I click on share one more time and I click next to the correct account I've shared it with. I click on editor and I click transfer ownership, transfer ownership, okay? And it says, you'll be the owner until this person accepts ownership. So. I click send invitation. All right. So now it, this is pending owner. So now when I go to my correct account, let me go ahead and pause this recording. I'm going to show you my correct account now. All right. I've got I've gone ahead. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen now. And you can see I am now looking at the same document or spreadsheet using the correct account that I want. It says you're currently signed in as that. It's kind of telling me, okay, you're... <laughs> This is the correct account you want to be in right now. So I'm going to click OK. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click the share button on the top right. And I'm going to accept ownership. Remember the wrong account, who is the owner, transferred it to the correct account. And now I'm accepting ownership. OK, accept ownership, accept. All right, good. Now what I can do is I can remove the wrong account, right? The wrong account, which is George Cal Team. I can click on editor. I can click remove access. Voila, and this is pending changes. I'm not done yet. I now have to click save. So now, one more time, I'm just gonna show, click on the share button just to show you the ownership and the privacy here. Only the correct account is the owner slash editor of this document. So the other person, the other account will, will no longer be able to find this document. So I hope this is helpful. And um, I know this is an issue with a lot of people who use Google Docs. So uh, please do comment below if you have other suggestions for this kinds of uh, this kind of issue uh, for others who are watching this. Thanks.